Hello and welcome to a new Thief 2 fan mission The Search for Crom's Blade by uh, Bad Cog. Now, this doesn't have an intro briefing, so once again I'm going to switch back to a notepad and read out the introduction manually. Your friend Roland, the one you served time with that got you on back to escape jail in the past, has given you an ancient map and scroll to help you find Crom's Blade. The map is very crude and in terrible shape, so use it only as a reference. The scroll was being translated by the mechanist priest, Father Lucas. Lucas didn't finish translating it before Roland stole it, but it should still come in handy. You hopped a mechanist train for a free ride to the excavation site and jumped out before it came to a complete stop. You found a nice cave that looks like it goes in the right direction. Now you must get into the castle. So, uh, there is actually a longer backstory in the readme about the tale of who Crom was and his castle and magical sword and stuff and that. Yeah, it's much too much for me to read out here. It's only, you know, five paragraphs. That's like an epic. Um, but it also says this mission is kind of uh, inspired by Indiana Jones and Mist and should be, you know, more tomb raider and puzzle y than uh, most. So that's going to be an interesting change. Um, so let's get started. Uh, amateur thief, master thief, and treasure hunter are the difficulty levels. I will stick master thief on, which is the equivalent of normal hard for the moment. But let's just uh, get the mission started and see the objectives. So the hammers started the search for the mysterious blade of Crom and failed. Now the mechanists are after the sword that is claimed to hold unearthly powers that only the bearer may possess. If the mechanists succeed in finding it. The world could change drastically. The last thing you need is for your greatest rival, Karras, to have even more power than he already has. Beat the mechanists to this prize, find Crom's blade, and don't get caught. In this medieval castle, it should be easy to find many valuable artifacts. Steal at least 3,000 worth. No need for a master thief to stir up any trouble. Don't kill any mechanists. The mechanists have already found the fabled Mask of Skelos. You don't know what this is, but the mechanists wouldn't like it if you stole it from them. This one's just for fun. You are in the middle of the tundra. There's only one way home, and that's the same way you got here. Find a boxcar on the Mechanist Railway to hitch a ride home on. So I pushed the difficulty up to Treasure Hunter. There's uh, an additional objective. Nine precious diamonds just lying around. Might as well line your pockets with them. I find all nine of them. Uh, apparently, they can be quite hard to see uh, and probably hidden in odd places. So I'm not going to do that. There'll be a lot of running around scaring the map. And I do enough of that trying to find objectives that I've missed, uh, uh, you know, ordinary things, keys and whatnot. So skip that and that's as easy as uh, not the difficulty I'm going on. So it's the normal hard difficulty. But I'm still not allowed to kill any mechanists so I'll have to get good at running away. So we'll start with a compass, a lantern, that's new. One scouting or one noisemaker. Three water arrows, six moss arrows, one gas, and one rope. That's not not a lot of cash, 850. I would like a second rope arrow. I assume they'd come in useful getting around an old castle. I'm also guessing I'd find a lot more stuff in the mission, but uh, I'll have to find out. I will grab a rope arrow. I've never brought it at all. Hmm. we we'll grab all the water arrows. I will grab a couple of broadheads. Uh, flash bombs are always handy for escape, especially if you're going to kill people. And... I can't afford that. That's pretty expensive. They're nice, though. Um, six of those are going to cost me... 150? Do I have anything left to spend 50 on after that? Not really. I'll just grab a second flash bomb. Uh, not much in the way of broadhead, so hopefully I uh, won't have to use them on much, but uh, there, is, there is a few. Alright, let's get going. Oh, we found an ice cave. Check the map. Yeah, check the map. Ice cave that uh, immediately fall down into and won't be able to climb back out of, I don't imagine. Actually, I kind of can. Ooh, what's with the, the light gem? They made it red. That's just weird. Yeah, I can't get back out of that. 
All right, let's check the map. Well, let's check the compass first. So we're kind of facing east. Uh, okay, this map doesn't show the ice caves. I guess that's reasonable. So there's catacombs, there's Crom's tomb. This is all the lower level. Below the torture chamber, water supply, I guess. Random sewers. Um, mines and caves. So I guess I'm coming up here. Navicon's tower and Paladis tower in the in the castle. Hmm. Wow, there's a lot of map here. But yeah, I guess we're gonna come out somewhere in the mines, and I don't really know how that connects. Um. So I will find out, I guess, as I explore. I don't know what kind of beasties I'm expecting in this case, but uh... Oh yeah, my keys are annoying. Hang on a second. Let me just change this around. I want W to rerun. I want shift to, to walk if I can. Like that. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, we got some dramatic music already. Is there somebody playing music here, or watch what? My step around here. Definitely should watch my step. There's uh, wisps. There's uh, icicles. It looks like another ledge there that I could maybe climb up onto, but uh, I don't know. Maybe it's just, I don't know how I get there easily. I guess I don't know how it means I won't be able to jump it. Oh, there's a mechanist. Where is he going? Away from me now, he's turning around. No, he's standing around for a while. Great. Move on, dude. Don't you see me? Alright. So this way down, I can drop on here, but then what? I guess. Well, that's dark enough. I might have that bloody wisp. Dark enough except for that, that's gonna give me away if it comes at the wrong time. Come on, guy. Come back here. Let's knock you out before you see me. Comes back. I right, used it there. So I guess there's more mechanisms that way. That's uh, east. That's down this way. That's a torch. Let's take a peek. Oh, hello there, sir. Are you just standing still? Do you turn around at all? Who treads there? Tis nobody. Nobody with a blackjack. Quiet one. Ah. Oh, they've got shields. Interesting. Huh? That's also new. I've never uh. seen enemies with shields before. Alright, this seems to be the bits of the castle here, I guess. These caves go all over the shop. Get in there. Anything behind here? Just a hidey spot. And some more icicles. Can I hear anyone around? No, let's try smashing them. This one's a break, okay. This one's a break. Where does this go? Back to the music. It's a long way up. Right, it's indeed a long way up, and I don't see any way I can get up there. Like, there's a ledge there, but that's too high for me to grab onto. There's nothing 
doesn't appear to be anything wood, although there's an odd beam across there. I don't know if that's wood that those uh, ice skulls are hanging from. But I doubt it. Oh, there's another one here. Maybe there is. It's really dark. Can't tell. Maybe, maybe that's my way out. I don't know. I'll uh, come back later, I guess. Let's go back. Oh, this is clearly a way to the castle, but I don't want to go here yet because there's a different passage I could have gone. Come back here. Firstly, I want to go more icicles, but they're not in the way of any. So there's that <sighs> passage up here. Better find a way in before I catch cold. Yeah. You, you can bring any warm clothes. Oh, hello. Another water arrow, that's nice. There's also the other way to go from where this wisp was hanging out. So I'm gonna just poke my head down here quickly and see where this goes. Tunnels of water. Oh, nice. Loot. More icicles. Right, so I can swim underwater and find out where that goes. Let's do that. Probably freezing to death right now, surely. But uh, luckily for Garrett, they didn't uh, implement uh, cold water as a mechanic. As a mechanic. Or ice caves? Is that mushrooms or loot? No, small glowy mushrooms. Okay, there's blue ones because they're cold. It's quite bright here, it doesn't really look it, but there's lights. There's torches casting uh, quite a glow. There's someone drunk there, but anyway, far enough away you didn't see me. I've got someone drunk in the castle there, but I can't get in this way. So I don't think I don't think I can sneak up on this guy without dousing those torches. He's looking this way too much. So I'm just not going to. I'm just going to go back where I came and go the other way. So all all the different ways should. Oh, well, wait a minute. Okay, so there's a another entrance. Nice, uh, fancy griffins and things on the pillars. Well, he does turn around. Well, if he turns around, maybe I can actually get up here and knock him out. All right, let's try it. Hello. Reveal thyself. You didn't see me. Your peripheral vision is just not good enough. Why have you got holes in your body? This. Something wrong with your textures. <clears throat> I'll call it frostbite, you know. Why not? Okay. Oh, I hear some groans. Odd torch. So, uh, are we in the catacombs then? Or the mines? I don't know, this isn't really lighting up to show me where I am, which is what the maps tend to do. Well, uh, I'd say catacombs, you know? Looks catacomby. Crom's minions lie herein. Now, who's this drunken guard who's. Singing wildly to himself. Ooh, he's dropped a bottle. Sounds valuable. You won't bother me. I'll take his bottle out. There's zombies walking around somewhere. But yeah, I expect no less from catacombs, to be honest. Alright, uh, I go down 
Demo sent me to the catacombs lower level. Which leads to Chrome's tomb. Surely, surely his uh, sword is in Chrome's tomb, right? I don't know, this, this map doesn't really line up with uh, what I'm aware of, you know, with, with what I've seen here. So I really don't know if it's going to give me, be of any use to me at all. Maybe for all I know, my friend just made it all up and uh, sent me on a wild goose chase. Oh, there you are. My creepy friend creeping around. That's right, you didn't really see anything. Chrome servants hide their eternal fortitude in this crypt. There's spiders too. I don't like spiders. Alright, I'm gonna assume I'm gonna need to come back here later. I don't really feel properly equipped to deal with spiders and... I mean, zombies I can outrun, that's fine, but uh, spiders I want to kill and I've only got four broadheads. And no health potions. So I think... Well, this part of the catacombs hopefully is uh, pretty safe, right? Pretty quiet. Skulls I could pick up if I wanted. Any loot? Anybody leave any loot around? Just bits of bone. Hmm. Okay. What, what terrible catacombs. Like, everybody knows catacombs are places for storing bones. They're places for storing uh, loot. Alright, I'm gonna go, that's the catacomb, so this is, I know I've got this entrance now, that I can use. I'm gonna swim back through the water, find the other way to the castle, and try searching the castle proper, see what kind of loot and things I can find there, come back for the catacombs later, hopefully with a bit more equipment scrounged from around the place. I also expecting uh, if the tomb in the catacombs is where uh, Crumb's Blade is located, then it's going to be locks that we need keys for and traps that we need knowledge of and stuff like that. So uh, this is probably going to, you know, be a better start <laughs> than just racing straight for the tomb, which never really does anyone any good. And more water. On this side, I just oh, a secret door. I think I like that. Two secret doors, and they sound rather wooden. Okay, this is a is this a storeroom. There's some crushed statues, broken sword, sword hilt. Can't go this way. All right then, can't go that way. I hear more spiders, damn it. Why do they make uh, missions with spiders? I really should uh, fix my no spiders patch. Right now it only works with the uh, original game. Garrett, climb, climb. Kill. But the new updates of New Dark, more loot. New updates of the New Dark engine allow extra patches to be placed on top of whatever's in a custom mission or original mission file. I've updated my no spiders patch to use that, then I can deploy it with any mission I want. Which would be nice. So now I have to deal with spiders. But I suppose as long as I'm like streaming a level, I should probably put up with them. So at least people see the level as it is, rather than as I would like it to be. That seems clear. Oh. Oop. I hear footsteps. There's someone in the hall there. Oh, I'll get the stairs down. Well, 
Why is why is my lockpick? Oh, it's well the keys are all different. Okay. I'm gonna need a key for that. Oh, hello. You didn't see me there, did you? No breaking their footsteps, I think I'm fine. Without the gear, the cog's full on conscious. Alright, I haven't been that way yet, but let's go this way. Ruined chest, which sadly means no loot. What's up with this floor? Is it a carpet? It's very quiet. Oh, collapsed room. Apparently no loot. Nice little painting there. A door that doesn't even open. Another one. Wish I wouldn't do that. If you're gonna make a door that doesn't open, just take the handles off, make it look different. You know, don't make it look like an ordinary door. textures already that were used throughout the Thief games for the doors that didn't open that were not, you know, doorways that weren't actual doors. Yeah, creepy paintings with loot behind them. No invisibility potion. Uh, equipment rather than loot, but I'll take it. Here's our friend I heard earlier. Empty chest. They're coming here, or they're just walking around and around. Quite oddly bright. Wow, that's like fully bright there, and it looks pitch black. I hate it when that happens. There's one. Yeah, now it's what? Dark, yeah, but it's just a little bit dark. This brightness is really weird. And the fact they recolored the light gem makes it hard to. to the Hush a while. I did hear a noise. It makes it hard to judge. It was a boy. Let's <laughs> be patrolling in here. Floor above or the floor below? Yeah, the floor above is wood, so if there's anywhere you're still on the floor below, which is stone. So we're in the Paladies Tower on the northwest here, okay. And um, that goes to floor two. Oh, wait, we must be on floor two already. This is the room we're overlooking. Yeah. Or. Yeah, I think we're on floor two, because I can, can certainly go down in the tower. To a stone floor, and then if we go up, that should be floor three, and it shouldn't connect to anything. Let's let's see what's up here. Yeah, this is the top of the tower. Hello, we have a blue glowy thing with no explanation and a way out into the snow. What have we got in here? Water arrows, oh, that's good. So, we have some kind of puzzle thing here. Blue sphere. Let's just make a note on the map. Later. Let's just see what we've got outside. Because, uh, wow, this place is thoroughly, you know, completely uh, drowned in snow here. We've got more caves to go who knows where. Lots of lots of different ways. Yeah, oh, I could probably get back up there. Maybe. What's this? Oh, Lila's diamond. Okay. Oh, that was a secret apparently. What's what we got here? Is this? Is this the cave I was in before? No. I have no idea where I am. We have a gate with a message posted on it, and 
a guard. Oops, several guards. <laughs> Lots of guards. Great, this is not... This is not the best place to suddenly discover yourself. Uh, if someone is there, then show thyself. Not the best place to suddenly discover yourself with no option of retreat. I don't think rope arrows are going to stick in the ice. And I don't have enough to risk breaking to find out. I guess I'm gonna have to start dousing these uh, light sources. Didst thou hear that? I shall sniff thee out soon. Oh, come on, it was nothing. It's just rats. Look, I'm just ice. Like this ice. Can I see what that? No, it says, without being spotted. Yeah, maybe. <clears throat> of course, darkness. Trust wood to fail a simple task. Yes. I should have knocked me out there. I had a good opportunity. <clears throat> Never mind. Oh, there's uh, his other friend. <coughs> Look what's on that guy's belt. Oh, okay, a master train key. That's can't we not keep anything working? That's nice. You go back inside. Good. Where's your friend? Going back? What's up with that guy? He's not even moving. Is he just like frozen solid, or is he supposed to be asleep? Or he's not like, not even got an idle animation? Or is he just going to jump up as soon as he sees me? Probably. He'll just jump up as soon as he sees me. <coughs> Stop. Oh shit. Ah! He got stuck trying to chase me, I guess that's good news for me. Could gas him. But I don't really think I've got any other way of uh, knocking him out. I'm not really any other way to escape. He seems to have calmed down a little. He's no longer full on attack mode. Yeah, he's lost me. Alright, uh, so he has a pretty hefty full helmet over his entire head. That just goes clang when I hit it. I don't, I don't think knocking him out is going to be an option. What was the pity? So I'm going to have to wait here until he calms down and goes back to his patrol, I think. That's uh, unfortunate. If he goes back to his patrol, he might just be uh, completely stuck. And he's still searching. Tannis will guide mine search, heathen. He's uh, yeah, a little bit bugged there. I don't know. I could gas him. I've got one gas arrow. Oh, if I had it ready, I could have got them both. That would have been much more worthwhile than just one. But he, you know, that other, the other guy's fine. What Get the this? shield. Ah, oh, he's been alerted too now. Well, all right. Come I'm out. A... Come out wherever it you is are. a coward game you play. <laughs> he's coming here to search now. For some reason. Your friend is unconscious, and I meant to get you with it, but I failed. So you shall have to taste my blackjack. Ha! No harms on me. How be thy hand? Oh, thy days of sin he saw end me. now. Let's run. run. Run, 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 I guess we'll find out what this goes about. Oh, body, bloody hell, I've got a, a bot. I'm lucky that's not active or I'd be dead. Oh, here's the train. Uh, okay. Fuck. Oh, he, he lost me. 
Somehow. I'll lift every stone till I find thee. Ugh! Thou hast stirred my anger, Shadow Creeper! Ugh! Ow, 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 ow! This is not going well for me. I, I shall cudgel thee! I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I guess I can run inside. I'll have to check the notes later. In from which came thou, villain? From the snow and ice. Oh, hello. I know this room. I don't know this room. Thy days of sin end now. Oh, the oh, oh, I'm stuck. And surrounded. Where's my where's my flash bomb? This one is near to defeating the intruder. Uh, builder. <laughs> Ouch! But I, I'm not dead, and they are all unconscious. I don't think I can get up there. I'm not quite dead. Oh, I do have a healing potion. All right. No, no, no. Healing potion. Let's drink that. All right. Well, uh, yeah, some some problems resolved. Oh, they, they don't look creepy at all. Uh, seven. Uh, guard. Thing. Someone out here was still angry at me, too. He was yelling, but I think he's out, outdoors. Hmm. Alright, well, I know where I am. The immediate threat has been, uh, resolved. Good thing I bought those flash bombs. Let's try this tower. Oh, is this, this is the same tower. Okay, so I'm back where I started. <coughs> Alright, so I know the way back to the train when I need to escape. Um, and it's just out the front door, or I can get there from uh, this tower. What was it called? The... Paladis Tower, okay. And from this floor, I can't get into the other tower because it's all collapsing. Let's keep exploring the first floor that here. That floor looks loud. I better find a way to walk across it quietly. Which floor? This one? Well, this one. What? The both just stone. What do you what do you want about? I think that's uh, scripting that was meant to happen if I came in this way rather than the other way. I assume. Oh, Mossar. I assume he's meant to be talking about this floor. But, who needs to be quiet when there's no guards around, huh? Oh, no, I didn't want to like that. I thought it was a secret. We've got a book. Excavation report, day one. Father Lucas. Today, upon arrival, I was impressed by a great sight before I stood Crom's Castle. Always thought of as just a myth, but now proven to be a reality. The Hammers did a fine job of excavating it for us, and luckily they failed miser miserably just like every other venture they've ever set out on. Most of the castle seems to be in excellent shape. I attribute its condition to an extremely rapid climate change. Legend has been told of Crumb's power and it seems to be true. Fires are lit all over the castle, an eerie blue flame that burns just as well sideways as it does vertically. I can't wait to see how water affects this flame. Can it be lit underwater? There are many amazing things here indeed, and I'm overwhelmed to have the opportunity to be here. Tomorrow we will start looking for these Ouroboros, supposedly the keys needed to find the sword of almighty power. Then it will surely be a great day for the Mechanist army. The day has been long, and we have travelled far. I think I will uh, wander these halls for a short time before turning in, but will save my energy for the day ahead. I must find that scroll and finish the translation. Where did I put it? If I left it at home and Karis finds out, I am most likely to be burned at the stake. I must find it. It is of utmost importance. Alright, there are these uh, Ouroboros, uh, the keys we need. Eh? Maybe that's related to the blue sphere up in the tower that we found. Well, that mention of the scroll reminds me, my friend was supposed to have given me a scroll that was half translated that I could read that I haven't checked my inventory for. There we are, Roland's book. Well, let's read it. Garrett. Here is the map that I told you about at the tavern. As you can see, it's not in very good shape. Hope it helps. I went through a great deal of trouble to retrieve it from Mechanist's archaeology storage, but I guess I owe you for bailing me out of jail. I'd say we're even now. 
When I was there, I overheard guards speaking of things that they've seen at the site. Among these were shards of ice. It might be useful for dousing torches. I also found this scroll, which might be of use to you. The mechanists have been trying to translate it from an ancient language. Looks like they aren't quite finished, though. When you find Crom's blade, bring it back to me, and I'll see to it that you receive a very nice reward. Other artifacts can also catch a fair price. See what you can find. From the looks of the scroll, there are other objects of value in the castle. I tried to finish the grappling hook so you could climb ice. I know you said your rope arrows wouldn't work, but just ran out of time, my friend. Sorry. Good luck to you. Your friend Roland. Translation of Dagoth Scroll, Father Lucas. February 23rd. The blade of Crom is a southpaw. Find it by adding light. Subject for one cannot see. Look, darkness. The two with one are bleep 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 respectively. Thus the one bleep bleep, a skeleton and two fires. Fire will be lit, blade will be bleep bleep. Ouroboros bleep the key. These are three bleep number and three bleep material. So, find about adding light to something. Uh, like two with one is for some kind of puzzle. A skeleton, the one something, a skeleton, two fires, the fire will be lit, the blade will be something, and there's three of these keys, three in number and three in material, I guess. I don't know, right? That may or may not help me. It may make more sense as I explore the mission. Uh, but I should have read that when I started, but that's right, I've read it now. I can keep exploring. Ah, bloody spiders. Alright, I shouldn't waste a... It's only a little one. I shouldn't waste a... One of my few... Broadheads on it. Is that the only one? I'm gonna assume for the moment it is. Can I hear another one? Lots more cobwebs. But I can't hear anymore. Okay. Good. So those are not my friends. The little ones are less my enemies than the big ones, but they're still not my friends. Another locked chest. Loot! Oh yeah, there's more spiders. Wonder if this leads back to the catacombs. Oh, the lighting is really weird. I take a step and I'm really visible. Oh, there's another baby one. Also, they have a weird bug that they don't see out from their forward from their heads. They see behind them out of their butts, uh, which is uh, due to them being misconfigured wrongly. It doesn't matter. It's gone, it's down, we've got a book. Day one. Today we begin the excavation. I've been waiting years for this day. A tower was spotted by a scout after days in the tundra. We thought it would be dead, frozen in an icy death for sure. But his return brought great hope with news of the tower. It is indeed good to see the legend of Chrome must be true indeed. I can hardly contain my excitement as I feel a great change coming on. When I find the sword, I'll surely lead the hammers forth into a new age of power and dominance over the pagan scourge that has ruled for so long. Day 2. The digging is progressing well. The men have a new found energy. I believe my speech last night had a profound effect on them. By nightfall, we should be inside the castle. Shelter out of the cold will be welcome indeed. Day 3. Inside at last. Slept great last night. A warm fire kept off the frost. Today we begin the search. The castle is large, but my men are dedicated and some have already woken early to begin looking. I offered a reward last night that will go to the finder of the sword, a large penance that will guarantee a very thorough search. I will begin to search for the Ouroboros as it is legend to be the key needed to obtain the sword. I have not told my men about this, as I feel their devotion to a cause is all that should drive them to find the sword. I have no intention of giving a reward, but it certainly motivates them. I have, however, told them to bring me all artifacts that are found, in hopes that the Ouroboros will turn up shortly. Day 4. Another day of searching and still no luck. I was sure this would be quick. 
All hope is not lost, as we still have more ground to cover. Day five. And the search continues. The men have been reporting strange occurrences. Sounds and moving shadows. It is hard to keep a ship of fools afloat, but we will be done soon. I am sure of it. Day six. This search is maddening. My men are starting to break. Walls are collapsing, and I fear my men are starting to desert this quest. Already the head counts have gone down with no explanation. These deserters will surely freeze and they deserve it. Walking out alone is not an option, but if they do survive and I catch them, they will die a most excruciating death. Day 7. The men are reporting walking dead in the catacombs, and two guards were mauled by a beast in an ice cave. One escaped with serious injuries, while the other was killed. He will surely die by nightfall. This worries me as only half of my men are still with me. They will be rewarded greatly when I have the sword. Day 9. Today is a great day. Early this morning a soldier brought me a large ring of gold. It is an emblem of a serpent eating its own tail. It is obvious that great detail was put into the creation of this object and I believe it to be the Ouroboros. This is the best news so far. What really intrigues me is that the soldier claims it was floating in a fire. He is bold and brave and has shown great sacrifice to our cause by retrieving this relic from the flame. His hand was greatly burned during this task, and if he survives, he will get a higher command in my army. Day 11. The search continues for the throne room. I'm down to about a quarter of my legion. A new report of a poisonous spider attacks is not well received. The men are growing weak. Hopefully this will be over soon. Day 13. Few men have survived. The situation is dim. Still haven't found the damn throne room. Day 14. I'm starting to feel this is a lost cause, but I won't give up. I have lost count of the days spent wandering aimlessly through this castle, fighting off beasts and undead. I fear I will not return to civilization with my life. And so I will search to my death. All my men are gone. There is no hope left. Well, yeah, that's probably his body right there, or what's left of it. Okay. Can I get the. Oh, there's a scroll. From scroll. When one finds two with one, and one with two, the sword of almighty power will reveal, reveal itself unto thee. And there's the uh, Ouroboros. So there's two with one, and one with two. Good, good riddling there. Can I reach that stack of scroll? Oh! Oh wait, it's got a... Hang on. I'm hearing new spider feet. But... I think I just picked up, apart from some loot... Yeah, there's another spider there. Crom's Ouroboros. Oh, that's gonna be handy. Do I have an objective for that? Uh, no, it's just uh, part of what I need to find Crom's Blade. So where's this spider I'm hearing? Did it just spawn? Down this hallway. Doesn't seem to be down this hallway. Oh dear, that's a big one. I'm guessing that's the poisonous spider they were reporting. I kind of want to avoid it. Well, can't go this way. I only recognize this place, I think, from the other side. Well, I guess I shall have to... Oh, he goes into that room. Damn it. Well, do I have any fire arrows? I don't. But say, there's, you know, these explosive barrels there, which would finish it off quite nicely. But, uh... Oh! 24 broadheads? I only bought four. Alright, that's uh, easier. Oh. Well, it dies easily, that's good to know. It's blue. But it's not particularly tough. At least when it's unaware of me. What's behind all these barrels? That's uh. Yeah. Nothing, they're just stacked up oddly. Alright, uh, that's a good place for a, a major save, I think. I've collected 
One of the things I need, the Ouroboros. I don't know what I need to do with it. Uh, I've found a bit of loot. I've found some clues. This door doesn't open. Found a bunch of clues. And, uh, I guess making some progress here. There's another way out to the ice caves. Don't think that's too noisy. Torch. Which way is this going? This is all west. Oh! Alright, no, I've been here before. Yeah, yeah, I came here, I came here before. That goes back to where I started. Yeah. Alright, uh, in which case... I don't know if I noticed this path down here. Let's take a quick look. But maybe I have been here as well. Maybe. Or maybe not. Oh, I see. Another water arrow. Well, these are the, supposed to be the ice, ice crystals that can... Uh, Put out the blue flames, I guess. Well, uh, there's definitely evidence I've been here before. Yes, this is... This is the fellow I knocked unconscious at the start. Cool, alright. Um, back into the castle. So, uh, we've had some success on the first floor. I guess we keep looking around. Rubble, I'm not gonna like that this time now that I know what to do. It's the door that doesn't open, another one that doesn't open. Don't think I need the rubble. Oh, got more cards. I'm gonna have very noisy floors. And some wood. And there's a mage. And another guard coming that way, I think. I would like them both to be unconscious. No. Is that thou, friend? Nay. What mischief this? Show them. Oh fuck! He's on me. Now where do I go? Unroach, you villainous weed. Yeah, actually, I don't really have an escape plan here. Yeah? This is not good. Uh, I guess I can try going out to the ice caves because I know I can get I'll somewhere. Not be so happy when my friends spy me. You won't be able to follow me here, at least. Okay. Noxious smell. Excuse you. Not that Madness noxious. Alright, you did lose me. Bonk! No! Well, he was still... Not us oh, yes, I shall. Oh, he seems to have trouble following me out this window. Which is odd, but... I shall sniff thee out so... Where went that weed? Karis only knows. I'm surprised he didn't fall unconscious when Where hast thou gone? I should, when it's dark, still be able to knock him out. Even if there are alerts. Oh, maybe he's different. Oh. There he goes. Alright. If I hit him too many times, I will actually kill him and that will fail the objective, so, you know, I have to be careful if they're not actually getting knocked out when they should. Uh, Alright. Good to know there's still guards wandering around. Oh, he's got loot. Take that. I think I sit in this. Uh, it's not a very dark corner, is it? This light is really weird. Cut down the banners, always. No. Doesn't shut. Doesn't get down. All right. Some kind of library over here.
So does it obey the first rule of libraries? It does not really look like it conceals the secret passage. But, you know, I might give him some slack for being an old, ruined library. I don't think I can get past there. See anything on top of the shelves? No. I don't think so. No. Alright. So much for the library. What else do we have on this floor? Oh. What's just the guy out there? What is this? Oh, it's a torch that's burning sideways. Okay. Uh, yeah, weird, but okay. Have I been here? I definitely have. Alright, this is the other tower that I can't get up onto from this side, I think. I can try, actually. Maybe I can. No, that second ladder doesn't work. So I have to get up to the next floor for that tower. Everything's collapsing here. Can I get through? Can I squeeze in here? Sue never looked so appealing. Sue never looked so appealing, but I can't get to it. I'm not quite sure why you find that sewer appealing, Garrett, but um, he's to his own. They're coming down the stairs. Or they're just walking around up those stairs. Sunny changing ambience. They're upstairs somewhere, right? I'll leave them for the moment. So let's try to figure out what we have on this floor. That's way downstairs. Let's check the map again. So we're on the ground floor here and um, we've just come off this way and we're looking down there yeah some stairs down to the sewers torch chamber I don't know possibly this map doesn't really line up very well so also it's very crudely drawn and I'm gonna have some oh it's an abominable snowman That must be the one that uh, Ray reported, the Hammerites reported discovering and killing one of the men. Snow Beast. But, uh, must have been nothing. Who is he? He talks. He is, of course, uh, Ray Beast. Right, is there a dark, an actually dark spot in this room? I don't like the light, the way the light propagation is set up in this mission, that's uh... Do you... What the? Full unconscious, you do. I hear other footsteps. It's... stiff. Shouldn't be a corpse, it's just unconscious. Yeah, very uh... Ruined... I see about the castle here. Which way is that? That's the uh, east passage. I could possibly climb up. Garrett. Yeah, I can climb up just. I'm not sure if there's a reason to. What's this? Another diamond. Well, these are the nine diamonds that are a required objective in uh, expert mode, but merely secrets in this. I'm not, not going to complain about finding them at all, but uh, I'm, not, I'm glad I don't have to go out of my way to ensure that I find all of them. Uh, what do we got here? A ladder. Oh, there's a whole collapsed tower, okay. In the eastern part. Of the map. It's not Navicon's Towers, I think it's this one. Yeah, it'll be this one. Torches continued to burn with no fuel. Sideways. And what do we have there? A window. Is there any way I can get up there? Is that actually wood? Where's this lantern I had? I had a lantern, I don't know if it's any use. Uh, it just hovers in the sky, okay. 
Oh, that's odd. Without really shedding much light on the situation. Alright, no, I have I have a bunch of broadheads, so I can actually test if that's what. Yes, it is. So rope will be fine. Let's grab my odd magic lan. What have we got up here? It's weird. The whole tower is stone, but the uh, <laughs> window is made of wood. Oh, another ice tunnel. Leading to some chimneys. Can possibly go down, but I'm not sure. I would want to. Well, that one leads to a fire. Hmm. Unless they lead to a part of the castle I can't otherwise reach. I'm not quite sure why I'm coming here. <laughs> down there. Doesn't really look like there's a way out. Well, it's hard to say. Oh yeah, it does continue. It does continue. At least it connects underneath, I think, to the other. Yeah, I can see a little bit of passage right there. So that's a way into some corner of the castle. Uh, <laughs> anything up here? Anything hidden? No, this is just sky. Alright, I don't want to drop down those chimneys just now, because I won't be able to get back up and I don't know where they go. But I will keep an eye out for the other end of those chimneys. Although, where are they? They're, they're further south, so they'd be over the east room, so I should probably be able to get in there, right? One of them had a lit fire, and that should definitely be uh, some mechanisms there. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a fire. So I will assume for the moment that I don't need that. But let's just make a note that I can get to the chimneys through the tower here in the southeast. Right now, where were those footsteps I was hearing? Probably through here. More broken doors. Yeti feet. Mm. Oh, a door that doesn't open. Oh, they're upstairs. Okay. That was, did this not hear that? Oh, a door that doesn't open. Oh, mechanist chair. No. It's a target. We have, uh, well, well, well. Yeah, sorry, that's terrible. But there are three wells, and two of them already have ropes in them suitable for climbing, uh, even though they look really small for climbing. No loot around them. Let's try climbing up. Can I? No, I can't climb down because there's a bucket in the way. Yeah, it's a bit too small, isn't it? Definitely too small. Alright. That's the dead end. Right, so that's where we can hear this uh, lady mage patrolling. Good to bear in mind. But I don't think I want to go up there just yet, do I? Well, why not? Where else am I going to go? Can go up here. <laughs> Very noisy. How many more hours to have? Oh, Eleven. It's cool. Not bad. She does actually come into that room. Let's make sure we're not visible. I'll wait for her to leave the room again, and then I'll just climb up and get into the darkness. Might have to douse that torch. I am diligent. 
was the builder that made me so. I am Titus. Twas the builder. the builder's sake, what was that? It was nothing. I didn't realize that I was coming back. Yeah, let's just this. Well, this is another noisy floor. What's the pity? Okay. Here she comes again, the diligent tireless made by the builder. <coughs> Thou art unconscious, it was the thief that made thee so. <coughs> There's another guard around the corner, so I just have to be quiet here. But, uh, oh, creepy table leg. Any of those candlesticks look valuable? They all look, no, none of them look like gold. Here we have a. Another guard at the far side, but he's not going to bother us, so he's a little too far away. Oh, he doesn't look like a mechanist either. Where was I hearing some guard? Oh, we've got beds. This is where I was hearing that other guard. Standing at the fire. Don't turn around, sir. What noise there? <laughs> Just my footsteps on the wood. <coughs> Nothing you need to concern yourself with. That's not bad, that's a collapsed uh, shelf. Oh, there's some loot. There's some boxes. Surely they hide something. Surely. No. Hide more boxes. Yeah, I will. Pity. Oh, oh, I see three chimneys. I think. Well, that's got a solid roof. So that can't be one of the ones I was looking up at. But one of these must be connected. One of these ones with a flat fire in it must be connected to the uh, outside. Oh, and they do have fire arrows, that's handy. Is this one? No. Uh, so one of those I'm sure connects back to the tower I was at before. So it's just another alternate way in or around the castle. Interesting. Cheap, crappy goblet. I don't know if anybody else is around, but I will still tread quietly just in case. Can't hear anyone, so it's probably safe, but uh, nobody's reacted to my little slips there and noisy footsteps. We have some kind of kitchen. That's valuable, I'll take that. That is also valuable. Nothing else seems to be. I guess this. Oh, there's a hammer. I guess this is where the hammers instead of the kitchen and the mechanists have taken over. Alright, here we have our three wells again. Uh, the next level of them, and this is the top of them. So I bet that just connects down. Oh, nice. I bet that just connects all the way down uh, to the sewers down below. Whew, this castle is indeed big. Can I turn off the line? Nope. Yeah, so it's quite big. I'll be noisy now because I think as everyone is uh, looking at earshot is uh, unconscious. Actually, I should go around that side, shouldn't I? Did we go here? Yeah. I do know there is another guard over that way, so I should be a little more careful. And there's lots of light. And 
Here he comes, in fact. Trying to get to a position where I'm still in the dark, but I'm able to see. Post to all guards. Keep on your feet, men and women. We have a job to do here. If you have time to lean, you have time to clean. Remember, we must find these items. Crumb's blade. Three Ouroboruses. The three scrolls. Any and all artifacts must be turned over to your superiors immediately. The eyes of Karas are upon us. Shine bright, you crazy diamonds, for the master is watching. Hmm. Father Lucas. Right, so we three scrolls as well as three Ouroboruses. Well I've got one of them don't I? One of each. I've got a scroll. I've got Crumb's scroll and Crumb's Ouroboros. So uh... God it is too noisy here. Let's just... I've got a bunch of moss arrows. So let's start making use of them shall we? Look how quiet... Look how quiet it becomes. Next time he comes up here and turns around, I shall be able to wallop him. I'm not going to leave him alive. Well, I'm not going to leave him walking around when the floor's this noisy everywhere. It's uh, just too much of a liability. Can't hear anyone else, though. Come back, sir. Hey. Right. Got a lot of light in this room, too. Smoted, and two land Ah! Fear thee the mace? Tis well, for thou shouldst. You didn't see me? You just happened to turn around just as I was hitting thee on the head? Reveal thyself and surrender. Ah! Done. Ah, oh, I hear someone else whistling. And not patrolling. There's another guard standing out there somewhere. No doubt being a, in an inconvenient spot to spy me as I creep around. Well, I'm not going this way, am I? Nope. Uh, this looks uh, quite firmly locked off. So I'm also not going that way just yet. Bloody nosy flowers. Let's stick some more moss on. Might not need it here, but I might want it there. Creep, creep, creep. Very slowly. Step carefully. Ah, yes. Hello? Nothing. Ooh. Right. Let's put you back here where no one will see you. <coughs> That must was useful. Alright, so this is a staircase. Can I get to this from from the other side or uh I thought I heard humming. Did we come up here? Oh yeah, the stairs up. God, it's noisy. More stairs up. And that's the stairs down. And here is another bit of broken wall. Leading into another tower. And the sewers. We are... on the first floor. Possibly this is the west tower here. And that's the stairs up. I'm not... It's not, it can't be this one. So I'm guessing it must be this one. Which would give me sewer access. I think. It might not be the sewers. I really should find out. I really should just go for a swim, right? Let's see what we have down here. 
I lie, it's not sewer access. It is a fountain that has overflowed quite a lot. And these torches do not burn underwater. Oh! A hidden diamond appeared. Bob Fountain. When I swap the torch, I guess. Alright. Uh, there is more. I don't think I fit through there. Let me fix my map. Because, uh, can I? There we are. Erase that. I'm not going to turn the light on. What have we got here? Just more power. All oh, right, I can get out to the water here, and possibly I've been there before. <laughs> and that bit of the ice cave. Well, I can't get back. Can't see any way back. If I want to go down there. So that's really my question: Do I want to go down out here? And you know, I don't know that I have a reason to do so just yet. But I'll make a note that this is cave access. Not sewer access. Uh, into caves. Yeah, come on. Alright, get on the stairs. We have uh, more fancy rooms. Windows look out on the stairwell, which is odd. And I think... Yeah, this is the main big room again. Right. So we're back here. Yeah, that's the stairs. Alright, uh, I think I need to go to the third floor then. Seems to have explored most of the ground floor and... Oh, well, terminology of this map, but... First floor and second floor. Gosh, why is it so noisy? But I shall have to still find out what there is on this third floor. Well, there is a uh, door with some kind of sigil above it. That looks important. It's a snake that's not eating its own tail. Uh, wrapped around the shield. Alright, so we have a whole new floor of the castle to explore now, and I'm going to cut this episode here and get myself a cup of tea, and then be back. Thanks for watching, see you shortly.